Hi and welcome to Car Tantra. Honda has decided to launch the City Hybrid in India. But don't think this has some smart hybrid technology. It's a full-blown hybrid. That means that it has electric motors that drives the wheels. In fact, the hybrid system in this car is so efficient. Honda has claimed that this car will give a mileage of 28 kilometers per liter, which is almost 10 kilometers per liter more than the 1.5 liter petrol version, and 4 to 5 kilometers per liter more than the 1.5 liter diesel. Not only that, this hybrid version will have a few new key features that you won't be able to get on the normal city. So let's get ahead with the video. First, let's talk about the hybrid system. You'll have a 1.5 litre petrol engine that is supplemented by an electric motor. When the car is driven around 20 km an hour, only the electric motor drives the wheels. And the battery is charged while deceleration. Between 20 to 40 km an hour, the car is still driven by electric motor, but it is recharged by the engine rather than deceleration. Between 40 and 80 km an hour, there's a combination between the electric motor and the petrol engine. But when the car exceeds 80 km an hour, the petrol engine kicks in. This is because IC engines are most efficient when they are at high speeds. Now, let's talk about the power figures. The international version of the City Hybrid is offered with a 1.5 litre engine with an electric motor that turns out 109 horsepower with 253 Nm of torque. The petrol engine alone has 93 horsepower with 127 Nm of torque. So this shows that the electric motor has around 16 horsepower and 126 Nm of torque. If Honda wants to fit the same electric motor to the India spec engine, then the car will have 137 horsepower. But that's not the main thing. It has 271 Newton meters of torque, which is quite a lot for a sedan. The hybrid version will have the same CVT gearbox as we have in our 1.5 litre petrol engine. Now let's talk about the design. The international version of the City Hybrid is only offered in the RS trim. This trim is focused on sportiness in its design compared to the other variants. Hence, instead of the shiny chrome grille, you get a piano black finish. But I think we won't get this trim in India. Hence, the design will be pretty similar to the outgoing city. The only difference between the normal and the hybrid city is the blue finish in the Honda logo. And at the back, you have the EHEV logo, which stands for E Hybrid Electric Vehicle. And you get the blue finish at the rear Honda logo as well. In the interior, both the normal city and the hybrid city will feel identical in terms of design and space and comfort. But there are a few differences when you are in the driver's seat. First is the new instrument dials. So you'll have an analog speedometer with a digital tachometer that you can use to scroll down different things. But the hybrid version will have a different design and it will show whether the electric motor or the engine is powering the wheels. And in the gear selector there will be a new B or braking mode. It is used to increase or decrease the level of regeneration and it can be altered using the paddle shifters in the steering wheel. And you also have a new electronic parking brake with hold assist. The normal city's boot capacity is 510 liters which is pretty good for a car at this class but the hybrid system's battery takes up the boot space. Hence, the hybrid version only has 410 liters of boot space, which is pretty low for a sedan. The hybrid version of the Honda City is going to be big on safety, because this car will have autonomous level 1 technology, or Honda likes to call it Honda Sensing. It means that this car will have technologies like auto emergency braking, lane keeping assist with auto steering, and adaptive cruise control which can brake, accelerate and keep a safe distance from the car in front. You'll also have rear disc brake which is not available in the normal city. Apart from that, all the safety features are similar to the normal car. Because of the battery and Honda sensing technology, the city hybrid will cost more than the normal version. 
Hence, this cow will have a starting price around 17 to 18 lakhs. But this is one of the few hybrid sedans on the road. In fact, it's like a mini Accord. Well, that's all you have to know about the oncoming city hybrid. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.